Hey, what's going on everyone? Today is October the 10th, 2022. Quant Network has been crushing it in the market. You guys can tell already from my price prediction that I've concluded on September the 29th that I was looking for that to happen anyway. Welcome everyone to the channel. This is HFN, also known as your videos. I'm going to give you all an updated price prediction as to where I think price is going to go for Quant. If you guys want the quickest and the fastest way of understanding where market is going to go, you guys need to join me right here on this particular channel. Now check this out. Like I told you, did a video what on September the 29th looking for the price in Quant to go up. It has done just that. If you guys were to go ahead and take some profitability off the table right now, you'll be up around 11%. Now, the high that came into the market yesterday, you guys could have been up around 21.5%. This is how this game is meant to be played. You understand what are the chances of what direction the price is going to go. You place the bet on the table and then you guys sit back and let the market work. Check this out. Let's go ahead and see if this is going to continue, though, because like I said, the market of Quant has been crushing it in the market. The market trend is still in place. Quant is still seeing the market go up and higher in price. Are we still going to expect that? Yes, I am. In the grand scheme of things, I'm still going to look for that to happen. Now, what I'm looking forward to on this particular movement is since we have broken this resistance area of one hundred forty five dollars, I want us to see the market hold this area before we see another move higher. So let's keep our eyes open on that on this upcoming or this particular trading week to see if that's going to continue. All right. Now, let's go ahead and look at the market in quant on the weekly chart real quick. You guys can see that last week has been pretty good. The market over the last two weeks, we've seen the price increase from the low of one hundred sixteen dollars all the way up to a high of 163 that's around 40 percent profitability so i wouldn't be surprised to see the market and quant begin to go back down because people would like to take some profitability into the market check this out as well i'm going to bring this horizontal line up here you guys can even see that this is the reason why the market and quant is trending down we are hitting and resistance area around 160 dollars this is not rocket science so we got to keep our eyes open onto the future into the market and quant to see if we're going to be able to break that $160 to the upside, all right? So check this out. This is where I'm still seeing the ability in the market and quant to continue to go up. Now, right now, out the gate, yes, I am looking for price to trend down. That is why I'm looking for the market to try to come through and hold this $145 area. If that continues, then the market movement in quant is not over for us to see higher prices. Real quick, let me show you all the hourly time frames. So yes, we are on that downtrend. Be prepared for the market and quant to come down and test $146. If we hold it, the market is going to continue to trend higher. If it doesn't, then we understand that we may need to go ahead and play the opposite side of this prediction. Play the move into the downside because this trend has been intact for a while. I wouldn't be surprised to see the market and quiet begin a downward move. All right. So let me go ahead and show you all another hourly chart. OK, let me go ahead and zoom in on this. OK. So you guys can see it right here. OK, the market is yes, it's weak. So let's let's try to bring down the momentum, the excitement of us seeing the market and quant do a massive run up over the last couple of weeks. We might need to come back down to life and say, yeah, the market is kind of giving us some weakness here, though. We, we may need to be prepared for this price to come down. OK, so I'm actually looking forward to that, but I'm going to continue to go forward with the idea that quant is still going to trend higher all because of what I'm noticing right here on the two weekly chart now we're gonna to have to give the market at least two weeks to allow us to see that confirmation okay now if you wanted to play a slight movement to the downside there's nothing wrong with that you guys can definitely do that into the market and quant but look at the trend like this trend is probably one of the strongest alt trends in the cryptocurrency space today all right so i'm going to leave this here well let me go ahead and take this off i'm going to take this price prediction off We've already seen the market in quant pretty much run up to where we expected it to go. And now our focus is going to simply be look at the market, try to hold one hundred and forty five dollars. We need to see it. If we don't see it, then we're going to come all the way back down. OK, to one twenty eight, like one hundred thirty dollars, even one hundred and twenty. OK, so I'm not going to put on a price prediction right now. I want everyone to pay attention to see whether or not the buyers are going to show up right here at our horizontal line because if it does, then that gives us another opportunity to expect price to go up. All right, so that's it. I am done. I'm not going to drop in a price prediction or a price target into the market and quant right now. I'm just going to simply let the market give us more information to make that determination to see whether or not the buyers are currently here. We haven't seen it yet and we don't move until we see confirmation. 
So I'm literally going to wait until the market in quant gives us that ability to trend higher, to grab support at $145, and then we'll get that confirmation then. But right now, we don't see it. Okay. So let me go ahead and let you all go. I don't want to waste too much of your time because I know that this is the most valuable asset in the world. It's time. And I'm going to give it right back to you. So guys, give me what you think. Where are we going to go in quant? Are we going to continue to see this market trend higher? Or it's about time for us to see the market go down. Let me know. Make sure you maintain the profitability. And it's always trade different.